Hey guys, and welcome to this week's video. As you can see from the title, it's a, a cosplay review from Asuna from Sorta Online, uh, and it's from a website called Moe Gallery. So Moe Gallery is a website that I never heard of before I bought this cosplay, and it's a website where you can basically get like anime merchandise, cosplays, even wigs. They had an Asuna wig, but this wig is from uh, Etsy, and I'll leave the link of where I got that because I love the shop that does these custom wigs. Anyways, so I found this website and I know I wanted to cosplay the cooking version of Asuna. That's what she's from. Um, from the thumbnail you saw this prop, which I got from Tokyo Taku Mode. I'll also put this in the description, but it's um, from the episode where she kills that rabbit and her and Kirito um, share stew from this meat. And so I always thought her outfit was cute and I wanted to try it. And all of the other websites, the pictures kind of looked um, off, or you could tell they were taking pictures from other websites, cosplayers. Um, so when I saw this website, Moe Gallery, all their pictures had their own watermark and they were all the, their pictures. So I thought, why not try out this um, website and see what, you know, the quality is. So I'll show you guys what the picture online was. And from those pictures, you can tell that it came with the shirt, the ribbon, which you can tie into a belt and make a bow, and then the skirt. And you can see me wearing it now, and I'm gonna be showing you a full body, but the only thing that I had a problem with was the skirt. Now, let me show you. The skirt that I'm wearing right now isn't the skirt that, whoops, okay, it's better. Um, it wasn't the skirt that um, I'm wearing because this skirt that came with it, even though when I put it up to my body, it looks like it'll fit, there was zero stretch and any bodycon skirt has to be stretchy. The one I'm wearing right now is a jean skirt and even though it's jeans, it's still, it's still somewhat stretchy. And this had zero stretch in it. And even though I always give the same measurements whenever I buy a cosplay, I guess either they measured it wrong or it's just because it's not stretchy, it's just not gonna fit. It, I would show you guys what it looked like on me, but it didn't even zipper. It didn't even start to zipper. So it'd basically be me showing you guys like my underwear and everything. So I just bought another skirt and I wore it with this and I am happy with the skirt I got. It's just a jean skirt that you could buy anywhere and I thought it looked even better because um, she wears a jean skirt with this and this is just a navy blue cloth skirt. So, you know, other than that, I really love this cosplay. It, the quality is definitely there and I hope you guys like it too. So that was the little try-on, and the shoes that I showed are from uh, Liz Lisa. Um, I'll leave a link to the shop I bought them from, but I think they're now out of stock. I didn't buy them for this outfit. I bought them during the winter just because they had a really good sale on them. They're like $50. But yeah, that was the cosplay, and what I buy from this website again? I'm not sure. Maybe not for cosplay because it was $85. But they did have a lot of merchandise from like a lot of obscure animes that are about like or really old animes like over 10 years old which I really appreciated and um, I'll show you what the website looks like here. That's what the website looks like and shipping took a while but uh, I bought it a while ago so I wouldn't just if you're going to a con this month I wouldn't get it because it won't come in time. But that's my review and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next week.